Hello there, everyone. That's right, it's 152 Friday. Happy Friday. April 10th. The weather report says we're in for a rare treat tonight. Shooting stars! Yeah! Yeah! I have not seen a single shooting star. Well, I've seen two. I've seen two shooting stars, and both times I missed them. Because I saw one was like, no, put the tool away. And then I looked up to the other one, and I got it like just after it left. Just after I hit the button to get the shooting stars. So good. All night shooting stars, which means I have to be on tonight, which is a problem because Friday is our Zoom hangout to watch Drag Race with friends. So I will have to maybe sit there with my switch on and be rude and go, sorry, there's shooting stars. Gotta get them stars, they shot. So I worked on a, quite a few things last night, just when I was, was hanging around. Worked on a few things. First things first, mail. Dodo Airlines, oh no, oh no. Why did we get more merch? How often have we been using Dodo Airlines? <laughs> Nook Shopping, Floor Light, I want that. Nook Shopping, it's my new song. I want that as well. I want that as well, thank you. So, what did we get? Dodo Eye Mask, nice. Floor Light. And a song. Well done. What are our easy achievements for today? Ooh, times five chop wood. Well, we're gonna do that. Times five chop wood, sell things to earn bells, collect fossils, collect bugs, change in the wood. What was that? Also, this may be the last day of the cherry blossoms. Which means I really hope that we get some cherry blossom stuff. This is a wardrobe. I keep forgetting this is a wardrobe. But I need a wardrobe. Should I change? Also, anything that you can open is a wardrobe. Look at that. Look at my mask. Look at my mask. Oh, casual pants. So what's with the zombie look? Zombie. 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 <laughs> yeah, there we go. <laughs> My look has become purple. Which I don't mind. Looks fine. There we go. There's those. And there's the zombie. Okay, zombie. Yeah, zombie war. The zombie wars. The worst of the wars. The zombie wars. I think I'm going to keep that for a minute. Because why not? With the hat and everything? Yeah, the zombie wars, also. Oh, yes. Thank you. That was easy. That was easy enough. Swoop, swoop. Yeah, bagworm. Oh, this time it gives me the catch a bagworm thing before I've gone and cut down a bunch of trees. Let's change up the hair, because this does not go with the zombie look. Also, I got the new hairstyle pack yesterday. Forgot where is the new ones? I don't see a lot of new hair. Ooh, okay, that's nice. Hmm, the zombie look. Or oh, that frames the uh, gas mask very well. Yeah, that's good framing on the gas mask. Let's do that. What's with that cute sunblock commercial pose? So it's the 10th, which is possibly the last day. I meant to put that away. Next, I might want to do something with the floor light, but I meant to put that away. Sheesh. Possibly the last day of the cherry blossoms, so I should make an effort to catch all of the cherry blossoms I possibly can. I also got several flimsy axes yesterday because I'm trying to collect a ton of stuff. Like, I'm trying to collect a ton of wooden things because I went through some of my stockpiles a little while ago. Haha. <laughs> went through some of my stockpiles and uh, using flimsy axes. No, I don't want to wrap things up for now. Stop that. <laughs> Using flimsy axes.
breaks quickly, which then gets you towards the, like, hundred axes you need to break in order to get your, um, super axe. Your golden axe. Which is a video game. I believe from the 90s. The golden axe. Hey, stop, 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 stop picking up random things. Right? The HOA is gonna get on us if we don't have our trash cans ready and filled every week. The HOA. It's bad. It's bad. Hi there. Let's talk. Oh. Pedal on my head. Superstar, make a wish. Sure. Uh, do you, this is normal for you? <laughs> is is me showing up in this outfit? I mean, yeah. Oh, what? 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 Wait, no. No. My bug net. My bug net is gone. My bug net. No. No, no, no. Wait, what is happening here? What is happening here? Oh, it's for sale because he gone. He's gone. He's gone. What happens if I ask to move this house? Is it cheaper? Let's see. Let's check. Can't hurt to ask, can it? Oh, hi, nice, Sly. <gasps> He's playing with his bouncy ball. Are you doing exercise? Let's grab a few of these fruit. And let's go to the cranny. Now, uh, several people... I've seen several people talking about him was uh, sent to me directly that the amount of money that you spend at the cranny seems to have very, very little, if nothing at all, to do with when it upgrades. Which is interesting. Internet rumors. Internet rumors that a shop upgrading is directly tied to how much money you spend there. Still need to get like 50-something of these. Alright, we sold fruit. We've got enough fruit to sell now. I believe six? No, we need to sell ten, don't we? It's ten-ish. Ten, ten or so. But I really, really need a net. I was gonna just wander around and not have one, but you know what? It is somewhat untenable. Somewhat untenable to not have a net at this juncture. Now then, sticks, sticks and stones, well no, sticks and not stones, well metal stones, sticks and iron, which is not stones. Let's craft. Yes, the bug net, thank you. This is why my bug net was broken because I went to an island yesterday. I went to an island yesterday to see if I got villagers the day someone was moving out. You don't. You don't get villagers the day that someone's moving. Now, what did I want to put away? Right, all of this stuff that I got here. But I did go to this uh, little island and it was river. It was a river island? I can't remember if it was special. I think it's a mildly okay one as far as these things go. Okay, right, I can't unfavorite it while I'm in that menu. And it was just floor-to-ceiling water bugs. And here's the thing, water bugs are not, yeah, they're not worth as much as... They're definitely not worth as much as, um, say, moths or definitely tarantulas or anything else that you can farm on these islands. But one of the key points for water bugs is that they spawn super quick and they're super easy to catch and you don't need to set up the island for them. <coughs> so while they only sell for 2,000 each... Yeah, what are you in the middle of? Well, they only sell for two pounds in each. You can win block chest. Hmm. You can fill up your inventory with them very quickly, which means that it's more worth your time to catch an inventory full of water bugs than to spend an hour setting up for tarantulas because the like bells per minute is higher. <laughs> All 
I learned a wooden block chest. <clears throat> now I did learn that the, oh, that's not a bad one. I've been needing some more inside table things. The villages that you get earlier in the game, which one of the reasons I'm glad I didn't really get anyone that I was in love with early, early in the game. Well, except for Flora, for you here. You were in the first five, weren't you, Flora? Yes, you were. That's the latest. You're making roads for us yesterday? I love walking on roads. It's a real f somewhere of going somewhere, yeah. But your first five villagers get crummy houses. Alright, these crossbred, but into boring colors. Well, that's fine. That's fine. 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 So, your later villagers, like Sprocket here, looking built. Zort, what's up? Don't mind me, I'm just keeping the peace. I'm trying to do a few partled jogs. Parch. Par. Par. Part roll. Part roll? Partial? It's not partial. Part partial jaw. Okay. I cannot read that word. <laughs> I've tried. <laughs> not happening. Someone will tell me what that was. <laughs> I'm writing it down. It's always a problem when you have to ask someone how you like what a word is when you're all communicating through text. It's a it's an issue. I mean, you can always do definitions and stuff, but you know, it's not the best. All right, I need chairs out here. It's one of the things I need on this beach. Is chairs? Ain't got no da -na -na. beach jars. I need to show y'all this thing I'm working on, but we're working over to that side of the island, so you will see it soon. Because while I spent yesterday going, you know what? Now, we've got a couple, we've got like houses moved. We've got some houses moved, so we may as well start ex like cleaning up that god-awful path that I have going from the community center to the eastern side of the island. Instead, I got distracted and built something else complicated. <laughs> So we're going to go look at that, and then we're going to have to deal with paths later. Also, I was really trying, but I cannot get, I cannot really get something that's going to look okay under that orchard. I think the thing that I might wind up doing with the orchard is, ooh, furniture. Rent, 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 what, what table lamp? Rattan table lamp, oh. It means crummy wood, apparently. Apparently means crummy wooden table lamp. Hello there. Um... What was I saying? <laughs> gonna, gonna do something. I don't know. I'm gonna replace paths. Oh yeah, um, under the orchard. Thank you. I think I need to build, or not build, I think I need to draw some, like, leaves and debris, like little sticks and stuff under there that I can put down, though that is where I pick up a lot of stuff, and if you accidentally hit Y over a pattern that's on the ground, it, it gets destroyed, whether or not you put it down with the path tool I just discovered. I thought putting it down with the path tool might protect it, but it does not. So I don't, so like the path tool one just kind of wraps it to the environment. Sort of. There's some weird rules with how patterns work in this game. But anyway. Eh. Just want to shake all the trees up here and be done with it while we're up here. So anyway, that's the main... Main concern with putting anything in the orchard. But the orchard itself doesn't look bad. We're still working on getting, like better flowers and stuff down there, because we're working on our hybrids. There we go. Uh, as demonstrated by this peacock butterfly, we're working on getting our hybrids in order. Thank you. Weeds. 
Wasp. Aha, I saved you, Sly. Had a wasp next ne nest. Had a wasp nest next to your house. Yes, I feel like where I planted that one house might still be a little too close together. The stacking makes it look less close together, but it still might be a little bit too close together. That's a common... What's this butterfly in it? In it. In it. In it. Aren't you a common what's this butterfly? No. Wait. Yes. No? Yes. You're a common what's this. Excuse me. Um, you know, while I'm here... While I'm here... May as well give these a little bit of a water, eh? May as well give these a little bit of a water. And though they're not growing the way I want them to grow, I need to make like a whole flower area. I have my flower beds spread all over the shop. It's not helpful. Not healthful. It's not helpful either. There's a petal. I also left a petal over here while I was making things. Because I was shaking trees and I caught a wasp and then my inventory was full. Got the pink. Got it. Got the pink pink petal. Pink petals everywhere. Happy pink petals. Yep, I did dig up an earth egg. Look at that earth egg what I dug. That earth egg what I did dug. I'm also going to be conscientious about my rocks just at the minute. Conscientious about rocks. Because I have a lot of these. They're scattered about. Oh, I'd like to do something with them. There we go. They are too close together, but I don't know. Like, you have to keep breaking the rocks until they wind up somewhere you like. Since I don't have a particular place that I might like them, I may as well just be here, right? This one's not bad. This one at the top of the path. Balloons? No, I don't see no balloons. I need to pay a lot of attention for balloons today if it is the last day of the Cherry Blossom Festival, because I've got like three Cherry Blossom recipes out of like 16. Oops. Well, that's the end of that shovel. Whoopsie. Also, when was this fishing tournament we were supposed to have? I remember that. Let's get, let's check the notice board later. Well, that's my shovel. So, since we just took all this time to get this stuff going, let's uh I need a amount of hardwood. I hear a balloon. Up there. Ooh, it's a real one. These balloons all do sound like someone just going whoosh, whoosh. Thank you. I don't think that it was meant as a criticism. Mama bear! Random stuffed animals. Random stuffed animals. I have something I wanted to do with a random stuffed animal. Mostly as an excuse to sing. I'm not getting any hardwood here. I'm not getting any hardwood. Which is what I need for my frickin' shovel. Well, there's two. Forget what I need. Three or five. Eh. I feel like that shovel broke very quickly. I must have been using it before. Because <laughs> I can't remember how much I was using it yesterday when I was doing things. Quite a bit, actually, thinking of it. Oop, there goes that axe. And that should be enough. That should be enough. 
move this. There. Also, flimsy axe. Nope. 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 Flimsy axe. Favorite. There we go. Thank you. Got so many flimsy axes. Let's craft. So, block toy and softwood. Well, it's not a bad look. I might need to make one of those to the bedroom. I made a flimsy shovel. And I know that it's a bit of a waste. I've said it before. Yeah, so it's a bit of a waste. Let's not do it. I know that it's a bit of a waste when I'm about to waste it anyway. Why? Why would I do why am I doing this? I picked up all the money, right? Picked up all the money from the money rock. Yes I did. Okay. All the cherry blossoms. I guess you only need thirty I don't know, seventy some odd to make everything. And I've got that, but why settle for just everything when you can have several of everything? Darn it. Well, hurry up, balloon. Seriously, I'm glad I've got a staircase here. I'd be annoyed at this. Still slightly annoyed at this. I did make your house too cramped, so we're going to build out a little curve there. Out a little bit, out a little bit. Maybe extend this, extend this cliff slightly so that this can be out here more. Move this out. We'll see. We can give it a little more space up here. I only want to have to move these houses once. Now then, shovel. I've hit most of the rocks, so I'm not going to be wasting the shovel for a bit here. Was that three? That's two. There's another balloon. That's an egg balloon, I can tell. That's alright, because we have eggs in the inventory, so it doesn't take up an extra slot. There's a petal that I left here yesterday. Okay, um, check down here. There's a dig spot down there. So, down we go. And shovel. And where is it? I never would have seen this. Still can't see it. I need to reorganize stuff to be... Come on. I need to reorganize stuff to be a little more visible here. Well, there's a fossil. So that's almost all the fossils, at least. Let's see, so while we're down here, anything down here? New. Also, wait. If you go out in the woods today, you're in for a big surprise. I need to move this, this thing, it's too obvious. But still. Yeah. If you go out in the woods today, you will not believe your eyes. That's not a peacock butterfly. I thought you were a peacock butterfly, you liar. You liar. Alright, now we can just jump it. Jump it, jump it, jump it. That's way more convenient than what we used to have to do. Okay, over here, you will see there's been some extensive amount of terraforming done. In order to get stuff ready to move to the museum, this will become our museum entrance. Still got to do some landscaping, and we need to build ramps here after we get this bridge paid off. But overall, look at that. This is where the museum's going to go, up top there, behind the giant T-Rex fountain. So I spent quite a bit of time fiddling with that yesterday. It was a pain.
Dang it, I hear the stupid balloon, but I think it's behind me. Oh, there's today's DIY recipe. So I have to sell stuff anyway because I don't have room for fossils in my pockets now. Don't have room for fossils in these pockets. Fossils in these pockets. No, it's over there. I mean, I guess I do if this is a fossil. <gasps> nope, it's an egg. I hear more balloon. Oh, wait, KK. But it's Friday. I thought you came on Saturdays. Anyway, first things first. Register. The new song. Oh, that's nice. Doesn't sound like a beach song, though, does it? Not a relaxing beach spot song. Alright, I haven't found any other dig spots, and I haven't found any other bottles and stuff on the ocean, either. I also haven't found my money spot. So I guess it's time to sell some stuff. Bamboo sphere? Does that I forget if that takes bamboo or young bamboo. If it takes just bamboo, it might be worth it. If it takes young bamboo, it's so not worth it. Clay oven and a chemistry table. Okay. Okay. Okay then. Welcome. I wanna sell first though. And a bucket. So even though the amount that you buy here may not actually have as much to do. Wow, I didn't actually get that much to sell. <laughs> sure, mostly I want to empty my inventory, thank you. Even if the amount that you buy here doesn't work towards the shop upgrading. I still try to buy everything because you kind of never know when you might want it. One, you can catalog it, which means you can get it into the catalog in the store to buy later. I don't want to plant a fruit tree. And you can also, in addition to just getting it cataloged, you can also just store it and then be like, oh yeah, this one little thing, I need this for this one part of my build. And that's great, now I have it. No running through the flowers, there we go. And... Okay, no stuff yet. Let's just double check if it's worth making those bamboo spheres or not. Because if they're just bamboo, I'll do it. If they are young bamboo, I don't think I will. Okay, they're just bamboo. I can get a lot of bamboo bamboo. So let's make a couple and see what they go for, since it's just bamboo. I'm going to imagine that it's comparatively little, since they're just bamboo. I'm going to imagine that it's only a couple like maybe a hundred, maybe two hundred bells. Not that much. Hmm. I've checked every beach and I don't see our... I haven't seen our DIY recipe for the day. I've seen this one. I found this egg message in a bottle. But I do not believe I've seen our daily DIY. DIY. Because I checked up here before. Huh. Huh. I guess I'll have to take another look on the beaches. Maybe I missed something. Maybe there's this, like, maybe there's that little corner of the beach or something that I didn't hit quite. 
And we'll have to see also my other fossil and dig spot. Hello. There you are, looking fabulous. Another splendid day. Sound unusually cheaper, but who can blame me? Who can blame you? No one, that's who. No one can blame you. Do not accept blame for your emotions. Emotions are something that you have and are real and good. All of the emotions are. It's what makes sometimes your reactions to those emotions might not be as great as they could be. So that's the thing. The way that you act is something that's under your control most of the time. So you can talk about the way you act. But just having an emotion, you know. Eh. Oop, there's more bamboo. May as well grab some, and then I can even just I can even just make the stupid thing now if I wanted to, though I don't. So it must be over here somewhere, because I didn't like fully check the other side of let's check up here to see if there's like a dig spot or something. And I didn't fully check like up where the museum is gonna go. Which is looking a tiny bit cramped, but eh, it's a big museum, it's fine. Alright, well now all I've got is my stone axe again. I still want more flimsy axes, but hey, what you gonna do? While I'm up here, I'm going to shake this like one and only tree that's left up here. A lot of this is bamboo. Look at all the cherry blossoms go. So tonight I get shooting stars, which means I need to be on tonight, because this is the only freaking chance I get for shooting stars. I'm going to sit here with my Switch. I'm going to sit here and look at the sky. Unfortunately, I have a drifting Joy-Con on my actual device, which stinks. Actually, I'm going to set it up on the table. I'm going to set it up on the table next to me and have my controller. I'm just going to rudely do that. <laughs> Because just, I need to get shooting stars. There they are. There's a dig spot and there's a money spot. What do you know? That's three wasps. Yeah, because I didn't sell the... Okay, four. I usually try not to sell the hives. So that I can, you know, keep... Keep things, uh, keep track of things. Look at that, we're already back up to 8,000 miles, even though I spent some the other day. Thank you for that. Well, there's one more tree up here. Are we going to get all the wasps? No, okay. So there's still some more wasps. Probably in the shopping plaza. I dug up a fossil. So, like, when we get some money together, later... Thank you. Also, at some point, I need to do an experiment. I learned the other day through a video that the trees, like, trees normally cap out at 10,000, but there are fertile trees, what people are calling fertile trees. Fertile money trees that will return whatever you give them, even if it's in, like 999 bells. So you'll get, so you'll get, um, if you're doing 999, you know, you'll get several thousand back instead of just, you know, right now we're making 20,000 per tree because we put 10 in, we get 30 back. So you make 20 per tree. This looks cool, right? So this is why I've been carrying that. Um, I want to see how this looks and see if it's worth ordering another one. This is why I've been carrying around this um, floor light. There. That's all I wanted. That's the. Only, that's where I wanted it to be. Hmm. I guess I can't slide it. It has to be in the right place, so you're not moving the thing. <laughs> anyway, I want that there and see how that looks tonight. And see the museum. Unfortunately, the museum is seven by four, which means you cannot center it on anything. <laughs> it has a two wide center, which you basically can't do. 
Not easily, anyway, so. There's this. I mean, I could extend this on this side by one and see if I can move the dinosaur over to half a step. I'm, I'll see about that. I'd have to redesign some stuff, but you know, that's not too bad. Though, though unfortunately, then it can't be centered on the bridge. And having everything centered on the bridge with the museum behind, you're not going to notice the slightly one-off piece of the museum. I mean, now that I've told you that, you are going to. And it's going to be all you can ever see, and it will ruin things for you. And every time I show you this build and it's completed, you go, that's nice, but you know, it's slightly to the left, maybe. Slightly to the left. Got more petals, thank you. So I feel like KK's here on Friday instead of Saturday, like he should be, because there's an event tomorrow. Let's see. There's my wonderful drawing. Shop opening tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, so Saturday, April 11th is the fishing tournament. So tomorrow is the fishing tournament. We're gonna have a busy weekend, right? We got the fishing tournament and then we got egg day. Hey, what's buzzing? Putting on another show before I hit the road again. Not taking requests right now, do my own thing. The music take more at once. Start taking requests around 6 p.m. Catch you then. Yes. Catch you then. I, I wanna get these fossils assessed. And I will. I promise. I promise you this. This I swear upon the grave of my father. The unfilled years off grave of my father. There it is. I bet I wanted this. This <laughs> message bottle. Cold windflower wreath. I have been learning so many flower wreaths and hats, I cannot tell you. I cannot tell you how many of these things I am learning right now, and I don't know why the game is so insistent on me getting these instead of cherry blossom recipes. All right, I need to uh, open that. I don't need a bun another Bunny Day vanity. Who? Oh yeah. Oh my god. It's a balloon hat wearing a gas mask. Holy crud. <laughs> How would you, you would not like to wake up to that. I mean, this I can understand. It's not like, oh, it's Dapper Willy Wonka. Nope, nope. Nope. Creepy, creepy mask guy. Guy is splendid. Ah, well, they are all things we have. I'm good. They're all things we have. So what did we get? Bronco tail, Arkelion stall, Stego skull, Iguanodon tail. We're getting a lot of Iguanodons. Lots of Iguanodons. Zebra turkey fish. I've actually weirdly been catching like one of those a day. Alright, let's do our weekly museum tour. I was promised I would try to do a weekly museum tour. Friday seems as good as any to try that. Because then there's been a little bit of change in the museum. We've probably caught a few more things. Now, yeah. like there's a water bug. Giant water bug and carps. Ooh, and more butterflies. It's pretty. And there's the, yep, beetle. There's the bird wing butterfly. Dragonfly, Alba, whatever thing, giant moth, spider, sand fleas, spider. Hello, you're nice. And we got a moth and a wow, and a centipede. 
A moth and a centipede. Mole cricket, grasshopper, ants. Look at the ants doing their thing and then coming over here and stealing coffee. It's very cute. Also, here are fleas. Fleas, what I caught off of people's heads. We have quite the infestation going around here. It'll be so satisfying once we finally get all the stuff in the museum built. Even assuming, even assuming we were able to pay for everything in one day, which like I probably could, but it would blow out my savings and like I'm trying to get the last house upgrade and I really want it. Whoa, look at that. Wow. So much butterfly. <laughs> And I don't think this is even, like, half the butterflies in the game. <laughs> Oof, this butterfly room. Look at all this. Yes, that's very nice. All right. Also has a slug. Oh, right, I forgot that this loops around. Okay, we've been in through this room. So, loopy, 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 loop. Okay, time to take a look at the fish room, and then we'll go take a look at the fossil room, which is probably the one that's changed the most. Oh, hello. Is it just me, or did Jewel Bill kind of look like sparkly metal toys? That bug you donated, right? It's quite a catch, you rock. I need to leave some stumps around, because these Jewel Beetles are also worth a decent amount of money if you farm them. Okay, fish room. Oh, the lake fish. We got a few more lake fish. I like those little purple guys. Oh, the little purple guys. Killfish. Goldfish. Popeyed goldfish. Rachu goldfish. Guppy fish. Yeah, nice. Also, there's our turtle. And a crawdad. There's a sturgeon. Some other rare river fish. Some incredibly expensive river fish. Need still need the golden trout. We still have no idea what goes in here. No idea what goes in there. Tuna, and anchovies. Big ocean area. Look at them go. They usually introduce artificial currents into the tanks to get the fish to swirl like that. I don't know why this ore fish is so sideways. I hope that's natural for them. <laughs> We've seen that tank, though. We haven't gotten any more deep sea night fish yet. And I don't think there are any right this minute. This part of the museum is so nice and soft. And There's the zebra turkey fish. Some of the, like, calmer ocean fish. Seahorse. top here we have the coral wreath display which we've been filling out got a few things we got the nemo fish and the dory fish and the whatever those fish are as the kids say children who know everything about nature from pixar movies now let's head over to the fossils, which is probably the thing that's seen the most change, I would imagine. So we get several fossils every day. We are actually hard-pressed now to find fish and bugs that we haven't found for this month. 
There are a few, I'm not saying there aren't, but we are hard pressed to find them. Why is there an octopus here? Ammonite. Amber. It's just for the evolutionary tree. The, um, so yeah, so it'd get M, that, and octopus, but tarantula doesn't belong here because look at how the line goes for tarantula. It goes here, then over, then doesn't go to anything, then doesn't go to anything, and then tarantula. So, like, it's basically saying, and I like that burgish shale thing over there, it's basically saying the tarantula is not evolved from anything. All right, ooh, we got a full ichthyosaur. Or auth otho al otho il All right, water reptile, plesiosaur. Yeah, we need more parts. Archelon, giant turtle. Giant sea turtle. You got some problems with the Quetzal. Missing one wing for the Parasaur. Got almost a complete Stegosaur. Got a complete arm Armodon. Ankylosaurus, that was it. I used to remember some of these. Still missing the middle of the Iguanodon? Yeah, missing the middle of the Iguanodon. We got the Parasaurus. Parasaur, Parasaurolops. Welcome to Gep when tries to read dinosaur names that he used to know as a child. Coprolite. Dinosaur track. T Rex. There we go. So we got the complete um, Pachysaurus? What are you? Diplodocus. We got the complete, no, almost complete Diplodocus, so I guess we're missing the end of the Diplodocus. Yeah, we're missing the Diplodocus tail. Alright, and we're missing the Demetrodon head? Bronchiosaurus. Maybe Demetrodon's the one that does. No, this is the Demetrodon. What am I doing? What am I doing? Why do I talk? Well, we've got a complete mammoth. Mammoth. Got a complete saber-tooth cat. Missing pig. Part of deer. Other half of deer, kinda. There's a skull. Austropith. Australopith. Which turned into, you know, me. Hello. The light knows I'm doing that. Heh, <laughs> that's funny. Hi. It's me, who came from the Australopith. Also, monkey villagers. Mice villagers and rabbit villagers we don't have an ancestor for. Deer villagers, hippo villagers, pig villagers came from you, rhino villagers. Horse villagers we don't have the ancestor for here for some reason. Nor anteaters. Nor kangaroos or koalas. Where do you come from? Nowhere, you just randomly branch off for no reason. You go, whoop, yeah, look, look, marsupials. What happened? I don't know. They marsouped. <laughs> Got that whole pouch thing going, you know. They became Australian. They moved to Australia and it changes you. Okay then, off we go. That was the museum. There might be more museum this summer, everyone's talking about DLC possibly, or just them adding stuff to the game. I hope it's not like paid DLC. All right, now I've got a bunch of junk to sell. Now I've got a bunch of junk to sell. Now I've got a bunch of junk to sell. Now I've got a bunch of junk to sell. Line reading. Acting. Acting. Let's craft. Let's craft a few bamboo spheres. At least see what all this fuss is about, eh? I may as well make a few, because, you know, I've got the space in my inventory, I've got the bamboo on me. How 
Come on, we can make two more. We'll be left with one bamboo. All done, thank you. Ow. Bleh. Bleh, I say. Alright, we got a money tree I need to keep. Got bamboo spheres. Gotta be careful what I sell, unfortunately. Got all but one wasp, so we got some trees to shake around here when we're done. Let's make sure we've uh, done all this junk. Oh, what's this? Sell a thousand fruit? Based on this fruit you sold. Okay, we need to sell 2,000 more fruit. That's a lot. Let's talk to a neighbor. Hey, Tex. Hey, yo. It's that time of day when I want a snack. Don't want to ruin my appetite either. Come on, give me one of the store achievements. Give me a sell a hot item. Sell a hot item! There we go. I did it. Behold my ability to get the things I want. Hello. I want to sell. I want to sell this hot item. How much is it worth? A hundred bells? Twice the usual amount, so... Almost a thousand. Oh my gourds. Catch fish, catch zebra fish. Yeah. Alright, you two. Sell stuff. So stupid bamboo. It's not worth anything. Keep that table lamp. Sell those peaches, sell that, sell that. Is that a bamboo sphere or is that something else I grabbed? That's a bamboo sphere. Alright, sell all this. Alright. 30,000, not bad. Not bad, that's how much I make from one of those trees. Also, the most important question of the day... Can I ever sell these turnips? My god! I get that I'm not checking the morning prices, so I'm only getting half of them, but they have been below 50 all week. Like, I think they were 70? They've been below what I bought the entire week. I can't even break even. And I do want this. That's cool. I'm gonna put it outside somewhere. Yeah, I want the lab experiments. I want the mad science set. Now, I do need a table, which is... Why do you make me need tables, you two? It's not... not nice. It's very not nice. <laughs> Alright, I'm pretty sure I either have all of these walls or they look boring as... All get out. Hmm... Um, and no, thank you. And I don't have to feel bad. Don't have to feel bad about how I'm not getting stuff from you. Cool. Blue, pink, and white windflowers. It's just okay. Um wait, what did I get now? Growing collection. Oh, I got five hundred things in my uh catalog. Excellent. Earn Nook Miles plus goals. Okay, so I need to get... Wow, I need to get a lot more Nook Miles plus goals. Buy one more thing on the Nook Shopping Network and I get another thing, so that's good. Because I'm about to do that right now. Get my workbench. My place is looking good, but it's becoming more and more inconvenient, which in my experience usually happens. Starting to look better. A little cramped still. I need to spread out. Here's a question. What's in the mystery box? Dark wood mosaic wall. Yeah. Sure. Why not? Oi, Nook Boy. 
Hello. I would like to talk infrastructure. I have in mind. I want layout changes. Excellent. What do I want to move? An island home. We have a... Wait, so can I not... Okay, wait. So... Right, infrastructure. What did I have in mind? Sell land? Prep land for a future home? Wait. That sound okay for you? Wait. I can do that? Okay. I thought I was full up on residents. Considering our island population land available, this will be our last plot. Oh, I, I thought we were full. Okay. Note, apparently I can't move that empty house plot until someone moves in. Alright, we got our access thing. I guess I'll check one more time. Um, Nook Miles, let's see what we got for fences. Iron fence and lattice fence. I have both of those. No, I know I have this one. I know I have this one. And uh, these don't change. These are always here. Green telephone. Blue cotton candy. That's a nice cotton candy machine. Yeah. I've got a lot of, like, outdoor food section stuff, so I should make a little carnival. Just carnival food area. Because why not? And I've got the red monster. I thought I did. Teacup. Clothes. Alright. Nook shopping. Mr. Flamingo. I have that. Portable radio. Sporty shades. Denim pants. Black denim pants. Maybe. Alright, yeah, you know what? I need some more denim pants, because I only got the one pair, and I keep wearing them with things. And, uh, bank, just... You know. Getting... Get a little bit more in there. We're getting there, we're halfway there. Halfway to the home. That'd be it, thank you. Hello. Don't know if I've talked to Frigia today. The old saying you can't... Yeah, you're going to tell me the thing about the coconuts again. Okay, sure. Got my nook miles. Plant a tree, chop down a tree. Well, we're just about to chop down a tree, so I'm glad we waited on that. I really need to fix these paths. Oh my god, I need to fix these paths. <laughs> oh, they're awful. Oh, they're awful. They're just, just horrendous. Horrendous paths over here. Okay, up here. I want to um, move this. Alright, I want to move this campsite. I want to have a... I was going to move one of the houses up here, but I want the housing kit. To, um... Yes. Right there. This is the spot. Nice. So now we're going to take care of this money tree. Still should talk to them, see if I can... I need to go back in for the, like, Nook Miles thing anyway, so... Let's deal with this money tree. I still want to see if I can move that house plot. There's an empty house plot, and it feels like I'm not allowed to move it unless there's a person there. But maybe I'm just missing it somehow? I didn't mean to cover that up. Right, I've got something that I need to plant here. There we go. Chop down a tree. 
Water flowers. Well, I need to do that as well. Well done, me. Okay, we need to drop off a bunch of junk. Drop off a bunch of junk. Then see about uh, going to an island. Because I need to do several islands today, and I want to try to do them uh, possibly before some of the other things. So, table lamp with in storage. I'm going to make like a yeah stone stool uh, for now. I want to set up some more stuff by the... Dang it, I put my workbench away. Lab experiments in the clay, clay oven. We're going to uh, upgrade our shovel, so I'm going to keep these here. Actually, you know what? Upgrade the shovel now, please. Let's craft. Upgrade my shovel. Up, 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 up. Been using this for a few things, so probably time to fix it. There we go. Yep, that's that. Put the walls away, bamboo away, that away. Put the stone stools and campfires away. I'm gonna set that up later. What what was this? Bamboo sphere, oh, dang it. <laughs> oh well, I like those, actually. They're fun, so having one around won't be too bad. Now, even though I'm gonna have to put it right back down again, I'm still gonna grab out my I'm still going to grab out my workbench because I can't remember if I can customize those. We'll see. Maybe later. I'm going to grab out my workbench even though I need to put it right back down again because I don't want to forget it. I'm going to forget it's in here. Hello. Hello. What's the word? What's the latest flow? I'm gonna get myself super hyped and just wearing to go. Then I take a nap. Works. Works for me. Excuse me, KK. Alright, one more try. Oh, no. Uh, what should I do? Can't think of any more advice. You've accomplished so much. Come on. Infrastructure. Layout changes. Okay, so. The museum, the tailor, the campsite, island, home. Those are my only options. And I can only select people who are here. So I can't move the plots before someone's moved into them. So that means that house is just going to keep being in the way. Redeem some miles, please. Nook ticket. I have a lot of Nook Miles at the minute, so... Hmm. You know something that I forgot to do before we do this? I forgot to check the Able Sisters. See what they got to go in today. Let's see if they like my fashion choice. Because fashion is a choice. There's a lot of things in life that aren't, but fashion is a choice. Except for when you can't buy clothes, then it's not as much your problem. Hello. Wait, got a cot. Ooh, I like that leather jacket. I may be leaving with that. If it isn't Gepwin, you're always stopping by. I can never stop working. Have a proper chat, sorry. Photos behind me of my sisters when we were younger and our parents. They both passed away years ago. This picture's bringing lots of good memories. I was pretty young when they died, so I don't remember them. I do remember Sable doing her best to raise me on her own. So I was such a pain. I'm feeling okay, maids, what happened to calling me Graby? Making fun of my apron. I'm trying to have a moment here. Not like we ever talk about this stuff without Gepwin to play referee. Aw. Was out of line. We should talk more. You're an adult now and I need to treat you like one. Really proud of you, Mabes. Lots of things, little sister. 
I took good care of you and Label when you were younger. Now we can watch out for each other. The Abel sisters work side by side. There's nothing we cannot do. Aww. It's amazing how the day just zooms by when I'm sitting at the sewing machine. I work hard, but I love what I do, so I can't really complain. Yes, I do need the fitting room. Biker jacket. Ooh, bomber jacket. Oh, do I want the black, the traditional black, or do I want the bomber jacket brown? Let's go for traditional black at the minute. Very short skirt. Ooh. But I do like the biker jacket. Even with these torn pants, it looks nice. Okay, input. Um, no, 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 thank you. No, thank you. Hmm. Not a lot of bottoms here. Poke it out, mini skirt. Poke it out, mini skirt. Hats. Dog noses for some ungodly reason. Why am I wearing blue shoes right now? Yeah, then let's wear this out, sure. Thanks for coming by. I Thank you. Uh, you know what? You know what? Just for those days when I'm not feeling the beard. Yes, please. No, I don't want to wear it out. You can ship it to my house. I love that they let you ship stuff directly to your house from here and you don't have to, like, do anything. Living on a remote island doesn't mean you have to go without life's luxuries. Continue shopping from the Nook Shopping Network. Wonderful. Alrighty then. Now, we need to get ourselves a little bit prepped here. Just in case there's like a bunch of, if we hit an island with a bunch of things we want to carry. We don't need the stone axe because we don't need to bring back stuff. We don't need the watering can because we don't have flowers there we care about. We don't need the slingshot because balloons don't spawn on rare on these islands. And we don't need the crafting bench because the islands come with one. So now we're ready to go explore an unexplorable island. I usually try to do this after six because that's when you can get tarantula spawns and some other rarer bugs, but I don't um, feel like it. So, the rumor that is going around is if you stand here and go hooray and applaud. Eh. You're supposed to blush the first time, possibly. It's not the computer. So if you come in here and go hooray and applaud, And he doesn't notice. Am I in the wrong place? I'm good, thank you. Let's let's try one more time. I'm not very committed to this, but come on. There we go, now he's blushing. So talk to him after he's blushed, and the rumor is that that will get you a better island. On a fly. To the look, Miles ticket. Yep, I'm good. Oh, 
Okay, I... I have no clue what island this is. We're gonna try to get some furniture and see who's here, but this might be Spiral Island? Or... wait, where am I? Lake? Lake Island. Oh, it's a weird pink squirrel. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Too many squirrels. Too many squirrels. Sorry. Sorry, squirrel lovers, but no. So is this, like, Koi Fish Island, I think? Oh well, we can find furnitures, possibly crafting recipes if we find a, uh, you know, beach jar. Squirrel. Nope, no thank you, squirrel. Also, I don't see any uh, crafting recipe messages on the beach, so I may as well collect all these weeds because we need both them. We both need them for crafting recipes and for achievements. Oh, first time we got an ironing board. I have one of those, so we'll just sell it. Alright then. Here's the weird, here's the thing with this, like, rare island idea. Um, there's absolutely no data to support it. People have been kind of just trying it randomly. But also, the way that the island spawning works in this game, like, any one island has about a 10% chance. It has between, like, a 10% to, like, a 2% chance. Because there's so many of the things. So, you can kind of talk yourself into any island being a rare island. <laughs> nice, we also got a fossil though, that's good. So we got a fossil, and that's kind of worth it. Still no bird. No bird, villager. So, sorry squirrel. We're looking for two villagers, we have candidates for two slots. Really thought we were full up, but I guess not. I really also need to, like... I really need to try to find villagers for the island sooner rather than later so that they don't fill up with weird randos. So... This is, like, a lake island, so does that mean we have a better chance of getting better lake fish, or what? Hmm. Oh, wait, I've heard of that, too. Let's, let's just see. I have heard of an island where you can only catch trash. Which actually, given the trash is actually kind of rare, it's more useful than it sounds. But, you know, we only caught one trash, so I can't say for sure. Wait, maybe. Hmm. See, because you have this, um, have a nice... Trash tools, fossils, trash fishing. Oh, I already got that one. Catch 20 pieces of trash. Hmm, but still, this is like, it's a weird, weird island, but if it's the island where you can only catch trash, that means that you can, like, get some of these, like, trash materials, which are. Nope. Well, I mean, kinda. Kinda trash. Maybe the lake's just full of trash. Let's see. Or maybe I got, like, unlucky slash lucky with those two. Let's see. Alright, so, you can only catch trash in this lake. Interesting. 
Well, I suppose I may as well give a bit of that, because it's hard to find these cans and things. A little bit hard to find these cans and things. Some reluctant to be caught trash here. Oh. Yeah, definitely a lake where you can only catch trash. Oh, well, that's not that's not worth me. Uh... Did any of those count as fish? <laughs> one. Okay, only one of those counted as fish. All right. Since I'm here, since I'm here, and this is an island I don't care about, I can plant a junky fruit tree and not have to worry about it. So grab some stuff here, go over to like a random clear space, and plant a pear. Boom, I now have gotten this plant a fruit tree thing. See, that's a good way to get rid of those achievements that like add trees and stuff that you don't necessarily want to do. All right, well, may as well grab some of these rocks before I leave, because you can always use stones. We've only got two more days of eggs. Only got two more days of egg stuff. I have more than enough eggs to craft the final couple recipes. And in fact, if I get some frickin' star fragments tonight... Well, not tonight, tomorrow morning, like... Shooting stars have them wash up on the beach the next day. So if I can get some frickin' shooting stars tonight during our meteor shower, which, you know, maybe I'll be able to do. Come on. Then I might even be able to craft the final thing, which is the magic wand, which I don't have any of. I don't have a magic wand, which means I can't change outfits on the fly like that. So give me these. Ah, uh, really? Fine. Yep, you have a timer on this. So after you hit the first time, you got a timer. If you accidentally dig a hole, becomes an issue. Alright, well, we got uh, basically everything we could expect off of this island. I'm torn about going to other islands. I might do a little bit of more later because... Well, one, I'm still looking for... Yeah, let's go. I'm still looking for the um, rare flower islands. Because I need I need some roses and rare flowers. But other than that, I need villagers. So I might do some later. And I don't want to use the nighttime that I would normally use for this because I want the meteor shower. I really, really want meteor showers tonight. And then after six, of course, we need to get our KK Slash song. So let's just quickly get this fossil assessed. Let's get this fossil assessed. Let's sell weeds for the achievement. Getting my nook miles up. That's me again, post-apocalyptic balloon man. Oh, what do we got? Oh ho! A spino torso. Superb, a rare fossil we don't have. Nice! Spino torso, yes please, donate it. Spino torso. Sure, why not? Wonderful, it's fascinating stuff. Spinosaurus is a large carnivorous dinosaur, roughly the size of a T Rex. Unlike most. Famous cousin, however, Spinosaurus seems to have a great deal of time in the water, similar to modern crocodiles. 
Firstly, I am simply relieved that you do not see flying prey. <laughs> Anywho, I'll gladly take this. Many thanks. Nope, I'm fine. Spinosaurus. Fun. I don't think I've seen a place for the Spinosaurus. I will check on that later. There's a chance we might get more of it, and then it'll be better to look at than just having the one bit. Look at that. Roar. Look at the way that the T-Rex gets framed there. That's awesome. It's like exactly what I wanted. You walk up and you see that and you go, what the? Now, unfortunately, we need to sell as much stuff as possible so that we can get that bridge done. I got the bridge to the point where we only need 100,000. I was hoping I would get a good turnip price at some freaking point. I mean, I guess at this point I have to try to recoup as many of my losses as possible. I'm gonna sell off more eggs later. And I have an ironing board already. And we need to also sell seashells. Yay! 2,000 bells. So great. So great. What do I need here? So, fossil assessments. Okay, only five more, so another two days before the next one of those. We still need three different kinds of fruits. I need to water 400 more flowers. I need to plant a lot more flowers. Just one, actually. <laughs> Greedy weeds, so I need to sell a lot more weeds. And 500-ish, 400-ish more shellfish. And I need a streak. So that's going to be a problem. Hoarding. More furniture in my house. Oh, I don't need that much more furniture. Okay, so going pretty well so far. So far, so good, as they say. Hey, I want to see. Isabel, I've done some beautification. I need to buy another Nook Miles ticket soon anyway, but I want to see. We've done some beautification. What's our uh, island at? Island evals. Yes, right now. Still three. Alright, allow me to get a thought we gathered. Look forward to Sunday visits. Alright, fine. According to recent feedback, we have whatever, one way to respond to this. Decorate the entire island. I'm trying, alright? I'm. Yeah, 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 I'm doing it, all right? I'm getting, I'm getting on it. That's it, thank you. That'll do it for now, though. All right, well, I hope that you enjoyed this episode. If you did, like, subscribe. Tomorrow, tomorrow, we have a fishing tournament. I have no idea what that's going to entail. I would think some fishing, but I can't be sure because I've never done one before. So fishing tournament tomorrow. Then day after that is egg day. Egg day. All the eggs will be gone. It'll be bittersweet. I kind of like having the eggs around. Everyone hates them. But anyway, my name is Gapun. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you tomorrow.